Daniel Cormier. He's going to fight again for the heavyweight title. Do you feel like he's really going to retire? Would you retire if you won a title? Would you do that? I mean, I'm not 40 years old, uh, but I will not retire, obviously. <laughs> Uh, he said he's gonna retire, but then you know, see how how long was was it ago, you know? Yeah. Um, yeah, I think I don't know. I actually, I'm gonna be rooting for him, you know. Obviously, uh, I want him to succeed um, as my former opponent, obviously. Um, but yeah, I don't know if he's gonna retire after that. I I hope not. Uh, but also the heavyweight division has to has to to move also faster, you know. Look at those people; they've been waiting, you know. Like uh, Nganu now, Curtis Blade is also at a really really good spot. Um, yeah, the he has to, he has to keep going and, and a little bit faster. So I'm glad the fight happened, and hopefully something will will result really quickly after after this fight. All right, one last thing before I let you go. John Jones, you know, you were talk just talking about heavyweights. John Jones talking about going to heavyweight. Gustafsson is coming out of retirement to go up to heavyweight and fight uh, Fabricio Verdum. We just saw OSP go up to heavyweight. Can mm -hmm. we see you in a couple of years, maybe, at heavyweight? Yeah, obviously. You know, it's it's gonna be it's gonna be part of the plan. But first, I want to accomplish a lot of stuff. You know, uh, in, in at the two or five division, uh, I've been fighting heavyweight. Um, earlier in my career and uh, obviously it was not like a UFC heavyweight you know they're really big you know and tall and strong you know and uh, you know in Europe it was more like sh shorter guy you know big and you know uh, just a little bit different but uh, you know the right fight the right opponent you know I, I go heavyweight maybe you know the my next fight if it really makes sense mm -hmm. but uh, first I want I want to be champion uh, at 205 you know that's that's a big goal of me I mean that's my goal and uh, after that, you know, we will we'll probably see him, you know, the more you the more you get older, you know, the, the, the stronger you get, you know, you, it's going to probably go be harder and harder to to diet and to keep my weight down. So why not let it grow and it get strong, you know, and uh, then you, you can eat whatever you want. And that's uh, that's yeah. a pleasure. For me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. Definitely. Well, I see the, the UFC heavyweight division in about, let's say, three, four five years from now. With all the light heavyweights going up, it's going to be the best division, one of the best divisions in the UFC. Yeah. That's what I see in the future. Yeah, you see a lot of heavy, light heavyweights right now. They're really tall, actually, right? Mm -hmm. This is like the, the the new body type, you know. All those guys, they're like one meter ninety minimum, you know. And uh, so, you know, they just have to stop cutting weight and just add a few pounds, and and they're they're good. They can just fight heavyweights. It, it's not going to be a problem for them. They're gonna be. They're gonna have the the speed and the athleticism as an advantage, and uh, you know they they're, they're probably gonna make waves.